Mark, hundreds of county workers and their union supporters, most of them women, said they are sick of the continued violence and harassment that's been going on here ever since 1995 when three women were shot here at the courthouse and the problems persist. Leaving their offices for the troubled streets of the city they love, King County Courthouse workers say it's time their security be taken seriously. We demand you make a commitment to make sure we are safe while we do our jobs. There have been a series of attacks outside the courthouse over the past three years, forcing a judge to close the Third Avenue entrance. Last week, things crossed the line when a woman was assaulted inside a courthouse bathroom. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. Workers are outraged enough little has been done to make them safer. They say they've been told to wear longer skirts and keep aware of their surroundings. Is that the message that comes out of the people in charge are be aware of your surroundings and we are aware. We are aware of our surroundings. Amy Friedheim has worked at the courthouse for more than 30 years. Safety. She says changes need to come immediately for the sake of everyone's safety. This has been an ongoing problem in the King County government and in the sacred hall of justice where people, we tell the public, come, this is where you get adoptions and marriages. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. Outside the courthouse today, people provide clothing to the homeless who've taken over an adjacent park. Workers say this isn't a problem specific to the homeless, but rather the politicians who aren't doing their jobs as they head back to work, unsure of what the next issue will be. We are here to say, get it together. Stop pointing the finger at each other. You are the elected officials. Pull it together and get it. A spokesman for King County Executive Dow Constantine says security changes are already underway here at the courthouse, including uh, limiting bathroom access only to badged employees and providing additional security escorts. He says additional changes are in the works. Live at the King County Courthouse, Eric Wilkinson, King 5 News.